Hi, I'm Nicholas. I'm a clinical director. I was using Google Forms, but I switched to Adobe Acrobat Reader DC. For more reviews like this, click below. As clinical director, one of my main jobs is preparing questionnaires for our clients, for our clients' families, for people in the community who are interested in what we do and the services we provide. And in doing this, I need a way to be able to uh, make easy to use interactive forms that a wide variety of clientele can utilize, uh, not just so that it's easy for them to use, but so it's easy for me to take that information that I may send out to 50 or 100 people at a time uh, and synthesize it and get actionable intelligence off of it to know uh, what is it that our clients need, what are the concerns they have, and how are they responding to us. Uh, it's vital for me in my job as clinical director to be able to provide the best services possible. And one way that I've found that's the best way for me to achieve that goal uh, is to be able to find out what it is that our clients really want. Uh, and by using interactive forms, by being able to have that data sent uh, in real time to me and consolidated, collated so that I can see it up against 30 or 40 of the same type questionnaires uh, is a godsend for me. Adobe Acrobat Reader DC is wonderful for creating forms. Uh, there's no other program that I've used that I've even come across that allows you to use uh, information that you have, put it together in a way that a client or, or an individual can answer it, uh, and then send that information back to you. Adobe does this seamlessly. Uh, it's shocking to me that there's not uh, software that had come out years before that solved this problem. Uh, we found so many workarounds uh, before using Adobe uh, that we didn't even think that a solution to our problem existed. When we started using Adobe, we realized that they are at the top of their game. Uh, they do their job. They provide the ability to create forms and utilize that information better than anybody I've ever seen. And they make our job so much easier by being able uh, to not worry about how to do a workaround or how to get a result that's okay. They give us the ability to get the best results in the easiest way possible, both for us as clinicians and for our clients that are trying to interact with these forms uh, with wide ranges of technical expertise. Google Forms is great in its simplicity and great for the price range. For someone who doesn't need a wide variety of options and doesn't need to be in control of every single part of the document they're creating, Google Forms can take you from being a novice at creating forms to having a fully functional one in a matter of minutes. Uh, they are very good at allowing you to work within their framework uh, to create documents. As long as that's what you need done, Google Forms is great. Google does a very good job at what they've done uh, with this forms program. The only time it became an issue was when we needed more. But for what they did and what they advertised and what they purported to do, we didn't have any complaints with what Google Forms could do. We just needed to explore what else was out there. One great thing about both of these programs is that it takes very little technical expertise to become at least proficient in both of them. With Google Forms, uh, with the help system that they provide, uh, if you need to make a simple form to send out, if you need to make a quiz to be answered, uh, you can do that. You can find a template for it, and you can find help and instructions on how to perform that action uh, so that within 10 or 15 minutes, you can go from a concept in your head to having something on paper ready to send out. Uh, Adobe Acrobat, on the other hand, is very easy, or Acrobat Reader DC is very easy to get started with uh, to do the simple things like creating forms or creating uh, a document with questionnaires on it for your clients to take quizzes uh, or to respond to prompts to. Uh, it was very easy for us to, to roll out Adobe with all of our employees without worrying about having to go through days and days of training. Uh, the time that it took on Adobe that we spent in excess of what we had spent training for Google Forms was just a result of the sheer amount of options that Adobe gives you. Uh, you can use the basic structure of Adobe Acrobat Reader DC and be a whiz at it in no time at all. 
but they've also got the option to scale up where if you want to get more technical and you want to do a wide variety of things that maybe no other software program has been able to meet, they've got those options too, and they provide training for you that is top notch. When I'm looking at these software, uh, these different software bundles to try to figure out what our business is going to ultimately end up using, uh, price is absolutely a concern. Uh, and free is great. And not having to add an item to our balance sheet, not having to add an expense is a wonderful thing when I'm looking for software to use. But for what we utilize these programs for, we were willing to take uh, a small financial loss to pay out a little bit of money to be able to access all of the different options that Adobe gave us. Uh, Google Forms, they filled a need for us when we needed it to be filled. They offered us something that we didn't have to go out and purchase and we didn't have to just blindly trust that after we paid money, they'd be able to perform what they said they would. So that was great. And Google Forms gave us a lot of good options. But the amount of money we spent on Adobe Acrobat Reader DC to get it rolled out to all of our clinicians and to all of our employees was minimal compared to the time saved in not having to have employees dedicated to simply creating forms. We can teach every one of the people that work for us how to make these forms, how to make these quizzes and questionnaires, and feel comfortable that they can do it with the level of expertise that we require. It takes such little time to be able to roll it out, and it costs so little compared to the benefit it gives us. It was a no-brainer for us to choose to make the jump to Adobe and take take on a paid software versus a free version of software just to be able to access all of those benefits. And then when you add into the fact, not just are you getting access to those benefits, but you're getting data, you're getting results, you're getting a level of of concern from your client that you might not otherwise be able to get. And you're able to open up a dialogue with people through these questionnaires. Uh, we can't put a dollar sign on that. I don't know how to, to rate what Adobe has done for us because we didn't have the options to do everything it's given us the option to do. Uh, they've taken our business to a new level. We're able to communicate with people um, all across the state, all across this region of the country in ways that we never thought possible. And in doing that, we're able to provide quality service uh, at a way, at a price that people can afford and feel comfortable that they've gotten good quality therapy every time they interact with us.